All right, what's up, fellas? So, uh, thought I'd do another update video. Um, this time I've, uh, I've decided to do a, an update on the Cold Steel, I believe this is the Indian War Club. This always makes me think of Last of the Mohicans. This was one of the weapons that, uh, I believe it was the Huron tribe that uh, a lot of its members used as a weapon. Uh, I do believe that it was mostly, okay, I think either the whole thing was made out of wood or just this part was made out of wood, but the round part was some kind of a stone. I will be completely honest with you, I don't really remember uh, that part too well. But, um, you know, uh, a good friend of mine basically hooked me up with this one as well as the, uh, the Gunstock War Club. I'm going to do a, uh, an update on that as well. Um, you know, he's my friend and I really do appreciate what he did. But um, um, I have, you know, because these are update videos, I feel like it's only fair I, I speak uh, the truth, at least to me. These things are awesome, but depending on your uh, your state and local laws they're not really practical for anything else I mean these are weapons you can't uh, these are not trainers these are not toys these are not movie props there's really no other use for these other than uh, you know other than fighting basically uh, one thing I do want to point out I still keep it just to show people how it came, like if I ever do a video or anything like that. Now, right about up here, you'll see that there's a little hole there. Uh, it had a, this, it had this uh, piece that you screw in, but that never stays uh, in its place. And frankly, I just, I don't know, I just don't like it. And it, it, it never stayed anyway, so... If I were to actually use it itself, I would recommend if you guys get this, just get rid of it. To me, it's kind of pointless anyway. I mean, you're going to hurt the guy. You're going to hurt someone real badly with that thing or not. I mean, this is a this top part is really heavy and it's indestructible. I mean, you hit somebody with this, you're going to cause damage whether or not you have that little, uh, you know, that little uh, cylinder in there or not. Um, this thing has never left the house. Like I said, it's got no, uh, it's not multi-purpose. I've, uh, I just keep it in, uh, I keep it uh, in the house. Uh, sometimes it goes from being on a, a sword display to being next to my bed, you know, for self-defense and whatnot. To be honest with you, I don't really see a use for these beyond that. I mean, if anything, they're really, Cold Steel's uh, specialty items should really be called novelties because that's what they are. I mean, it's fun when you have friends over for a barbecue. It's like, hey, check this out, you know, smash a few cinder blocks, watermelon, stuff like that. You know, it, it's it's a fun little uh, party, you know, like it's it's fun to like entertain people at like a party, something like that. Other than that and, uh, you know, actual uh, self-defense applications, I don't really see much of a use beyond these. This is, at least here in Texas, this is not something that... Uh, you can walk around with or anything like that. Uh, the keeping it in a vehicle, um, I'm not sure. I think uh, the rule in Texas is, uh, you know, uh, clubs that are uh, anything that can be used as a club is unlawful to possess on your person, but you can have it in your house in your car. So I mean, maybe you can hang it like uh, you can hang it. Uh, you know, like gun rack style, whatever you want to call it. But like us, and that's just here in Texas. It uh, it really just depends on where you're from. But uh, other than that, I mean, like I said, these are uh, these are nifty little items, but very limited in terms of uh, of their use. At least with the walking sticks, they can be used in more ways than one. You know, they function as walking aids and can be uh, used in self defense. These have no other function except to hurt people. Uh, so overall, great item but lim uh, limited use and uh, if any of you guys are thinking of purchasing this you may want to keep that in mind and uh, that's really all I got to say about that peace out fellas